Hello, perfectly imperfect people. Welcome to today's unboxing, one that I thought would never happen again. This is the Wizarding World. Hello, Yoshi. Excuse me. Thank you. Okay, bye now. <laughs> Um, Wizarding World Loot Crate. Um, I last Black Friday signed up for a six month subscription, which is three boxes. It was 50% off. Um, the boxes were fine, but then I discovered the Wizard's Vault and decided that I wouldn't renew my Loot Crate because Loot Crate had had all kinds of shipping issues. Boxes were super late. Um, and it turned out that they were having financial trouble. They finally got bought out. Um, so they were going to continue. Anyway, um, I thought that I just purchased a one-time subscription, that it wouldn't automatically renew, but it did. So in like July, maybe, this renewed, um, and it's the end of October. Tomorrow's Halloween. So that is how long it took to get this next box. Um, so I have already canceled my subscription for this. So I'll be getting three boxes um, and then no more. This one is magical plants, like a herbology theme. It's got a little, well, it's upside down, but it's got an Android on it. So, um, let's see what's in this i as a hufflepuff should be really good with plants and love them i can't keep them alive to save my life give me a dog or a cat we're good to go i can keep them alive plants not so much so i'm not that into herbology but we'll see what we got um oh it has dirigible plums on the box i do like that uh, ooh, this t-shirt's really soft. So, this is cute, but it's kind of creepy. So this is the shirt. It's a mandrake. It's kind of a heathered um, look to it. And it's got pretty pink and green colors. But that mandrake looks a little too much like a fetus for my taste. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, um, yeah, we'll see. I'm not crazy about it. Um, things like that kind of freak me out. Okay. Um, okay, there's a wall tapestry, Herbology 101 wall tapestry. This is gonna be huge. Let's see if I can get it out and show you. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put a wall tapestry. Um, I already have my Couple Puff and um, Gryffindor flags for my husband. Or banners. Maybe I only have a Couple Puff one. I don't think he has one. I think it's just me. Um, it's very see through. So. Oh, and I think it goes this way. So, Herbology 101. We've got some things that I can't see. So, you can probably see better than me. So, lots of magical plants. It's pretty. I just don't know where I'm going to put it. I'm having a hard time figuring out where I'm going to put my Harry Potter collection anyway. And when we repaired our house after the hurricane we actually knocked walls down to open it up and make this bigger room that you see behind me um kitchen is in front of me living room behind used to be a wall basically where i'm sitting that was like my office that i never used so made of this huge room it's fantastic but there are less walls for hanging things so um we'll see how this pans out with that um, this looks cute. It says bow truckle handkerchief. I like bow truckles. I love picket. Oh, it's really pretty. It's a purple. And it has little bow truckles on it. 
It's got Newt's, Newt's Commanders. Yep. Seal on the bottom there. Oh, it's lovely. I can probably set this out um, with my Fantastic Beast Pops and everything. So that'll be a nice little accent to my display. I like that very much. We have Dirigible Plum Magnets. This is cute. Um, it says keep off of the Dirigible Plums. Again, I don't know what I'll do with these, but they're super cute. Um, we'll figure it out. I like that. And we have our pin as usual. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's the Kelpie from Fantastic Beasts Crimes of Grindelwald. I do like their pens that they put in the boxes. They are usually a pretty, um, I guess it's enamel, but it almost looks like resin because it's clear and kind of shimmery and they always have the outlines. I do like that. Um, I need a pin board. Maybe I can turn this herbology tapestry into the background of a pin board, who knows. All right, that is it. Let's look at the packing slip. Magical plants. It says everything is a Loot Crate exclusive. Now, something that I realized is that I think they're only exclusive to Loot Crate for a little while because I was just in Second and Charles, um, which doesn't just have secondhand things, it also has new items. And in the new section, there was the Kelpie coffee cup that I had gotten a couple of boxes back. So that was supposed to be a Loot Crate exclusive, not so exclusive anymore. Um, so, you know, if you love something in here, you might see it somewhere else later, who knows? Okay, so yeah, bow charcoal handkerchief, Tapestry, Mandrake shirt, magnet set, Kelpie pin. It's a fine box. Um, I wish I had not had my subscription renew and I wish I hadn't paid so much money for it because it was not 50% off the second time around. But there's some cute things in here. And so, you know, like I said, we'll just See how it goes. My favorite thing is the um, handkerchief with the bow truckles because I really like that. Like, they're so cute. And it can be easily displayed um, with some other things. I have no need for a handkerchief <laughs> in the life, as most people don't nowadays. So I won't be using it as such, but um, it's a nice little display item. So. Let me know if you're still on the Loot Crate train or if you are like me and are just waiting for your subscription to run out. Um, yeah, and who knows, maybe something here will turn up in a giveaway. Uh, just like I said, I don't have room for this tapestry. It's lovely, but where the heck am I gonna put it? It's large. It's, let's see if I can figure this out. I mean, like, I even have it undone all the way, you guys. <laughs> it's, okay, it's my entire wingspan, so your arms are supposed to be as tall as you are. I'm 5'3", so it's probably a good 5 feet by, it's like a 5 by 5 tapestry. That is a massive chunk of wall. And this is not what I would put on a size, a sizable chunk of wall like that. So we'll see. Maybe I'll give it away. Like I said, herbology is not my thing. I think it's cool, but um, let's leave it to Neville and Professor Sprout and, you know, Hufflepuffs that like plants. <laughs> Okay, so I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you want, and I will see y'all next time. Bye.